Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. My name is Jalal Ahmed, and I welcome you in this Java Swing series uh, in Need Beans. Uh, and in this tutorial, we will uh, do a simple task. It's not rocket science, and uh, the task is that um, we will. Uh, you must have seen a reset button often in some softwares, uh, which says reset to defaults or something else, or restore to defaults, or mm, we. I mean that we will be adding a button which will restore our defaults uh, of J table of the combo box and the fields. So for that purpose, I would like to add a button that is um, J button, and uh, right here restore. Sorry, I spelled it wrong and i would like to mention now double click and when you double click just write here the function name which clears all all the fields so copy name of this uh, method and come here and write it in here okay shift f6 and if I click something and click restore you can see it is restored uh, to its default values and but you can see it is not restoring to its default values J combo box remains the same so I would like to go to this method again and would like to write here the name of the combo box that is i am remembering it uh j combo box uh, one dot let me show you change video this is the name copy it and come here and we have written already in here so j combo box dot dot set set selected index to zero zero means that we want to set selected item as the first one so for that we just write here the zero uh, now press shift f6 and you can see if i click here a row and click restore you can see it sets to the first index okay so also you can write here update um, table method that is updating the table which which we have written earlier in this series that is in here and this is the method and similarly it will be a good practice to write it uh, now click it and you can see the selection becomes disappeared and everything becomes the same which we just uh, initially saw uh, at the at this gui so this was about this tutorial and hope you guys have learned something and uh, please stay tuned for next tutorials rate comment and subscribe my channel and thanks for now